Next in the tank is a product to help kids love washing up. Hi Sharks, I'm Amanat Anand. I'm Shabam Isser, and we're the co-founders of Sopen. We're seeking $100,000 for 10% equity in our company. Shub, did you wash your hands? Yes. Did you use soap? What are you, my mom? Of course I did. <laughs> we all know these are questions parents have to ask multiple times a day. Let's face it, kids don't like stopping what they're doing to wash their hands, and when they do, they don't wash properly or for the right amount of time. Plus, kids love drawing on everything, tables, walls, and even on their own bodies. We put these two problems together and created a solution. Soap pen! A colorful soap-filled pen that kids can draw with. With soap pen, kids can draw their germs away. Kids draw fun designs all over their hands, just like the shark Amanat is making right now. <laughs> then they rub their hands together and rinse off, just like normal. So Pen's gentle, vibrant, and stain-free formula was designed to make kids thoroughly wash their hands for 20 to 40 seconds to get all that colorful soap off, creating healthier kids and happier parents. Regardless of a pandemic, hand washing with soap is a golden rule of prevention. It can save one out of three children from catching the most deadly diseases globally. So Sharks, who wants to make hand washing fun for kids with soap Pen? Brilliant idea. Why has nobody ever thought of this? Because they, they did. <laughs> <laughs> We're using food grade colorants and we are sulfate free. We're phthalate free, coconut derived. So it is a very gentle and mild formula. It's pretty cool. Mine smells, I think, like blueberry. Yeah, berry blast. Yeah, so, you know, smart to put a fragrance to it because kids yeah. love that. It's a beautiful product. It's really beautiful, and it's a really neat idea. How did you guys come up with this? So Manit and I grew up in India. We, at 17, we moved to the United States to study industrial design at the Parsons School of Design in New York. Wow. Um, we loved working together while we were in college, and we wanted to make sure that we're using our skills for good. And we came across the UNICEF Variables for Good Challenge, which highlighted horrible statistics around infant mortality and how a ton of these diseases can be avoided by just washing your hands with soap. And that's how we came up with the idea of soap. And we went on to win the challenge and use the prize money to start R&D and make soap and a reality. Congratulations. Wow. Thank you. So tell me, what are your sales? So in lifetime, we've done $85,000 in sales. Uh, we launched a beta version of Soap Pen in 2019. At the time, we hadn't raised any funding and had no marketing budget. So we were definitely very lost, but we got an article in Real Simple Magazine in October of 2019. And we had no idea what the power of print media is. We sold out of our entire inventory in Which three weeks. Which was how many? Weeks. It was 5,000 units that, were that we over. sold out in three weeks. So you had that print, you yes. got a blip yeah. in sales. Are you still selling? So that really validated the demand for the product, which was not something we were sure of early right. on. And then it gave us the confidence to go out there, fundraise, and we got a ton of product feedback from that first beta version. And then we took that money that we raised How much to did go you back. raise? So we raised $225,000 wow. at a one million valuation. We just closed That's it. That's a lot. All right. What does it cost and what is um, your cost? So it's $14.99 for a pack of three. Manufacturing a single pack of three is $4.30. Our blended profit margin across all channels is 40%. How are you selling it? What are you doing to market and sell your product? So we've been running ads on Amazon right now. It's only been two months, so it's, so, it's very hard to What's your return on ad spend? It's, it, we're still determining that. It's, it's been two months, so we ha don't have a good number yet. And well, that means it's not good or and you don't want to tell me because two months is enough time. One day is enough time. I know. You have to make sure you're getting that return on ad spend. Otherwise, that money disappears like that, particularly yeah. with the categories you're in. And let me point something out, OK? A product like this, which has merit, OK? I'm going to give you a lot of credit for what you've built here because it's a new iteration of, of soap for children that is really appealing. I get it. But what's missing in your equation, all right, is an understanding of the sales process and how you get leverage to do that and reducing your customer acquisition costs. Somebody should be pounding out content every day to the algorithm yes. set by TikTok, by Instagram, Twitter every day because you want to get these customers for free. Really savvy marketers do that with products like this. And I don't think you have that nailed down yet. So for that reason, because I think you're too early, I'm out.
Look guys, you're not too early, but you haven't found a way to sell it yet. I would get on every message board on Facebook, every group I can find on Nextdoor and everywhere, posting pictures, posting videos, and telling them about your product. That's a 24 by seven by 365 job. Yeah. You just have to eat, sleep, and breathe it, and it be relentless. This is not you know, an investment for me, so for those reasons I'm out, but I think you've got a great product, but you've just got to get out there and be relentless. Look, I, I couldn't admire and respect you more. I wish you all the best, but for now, I'm out. Listen, ladies, you've done a great job. I mean, you're just out of school, and you create a product that is a better mousetrap, so to speak. That's the best inventions are things that are just something smarter than what already existed. But it's just too early for me as an investment. I wish you good luck, but I'm out. Lori, kids need this right now, they especially do. with the pandemic. So, they do. you know, we finally Lori's have supply out. chain. You have one shark left near off right here. Well, well, guys, there is so much to like about you. Just listening to your story and even seeing you struggle up there, it reminds me of being an entrepreneur and trying to sell. In fact, little known fact, I had a company in between my first success and next door, and I pitched it to Mr. Cuban over here. And he treated me not so differently than some of the sharks are treating you. A lot of good advice, but ultimately it wasn't right. I think it may be a little too early for you to take on more investment. My advice to you guys is to find some mentors and continue to iterate. I believe very deeply in you guys. But for those reasons, as an investment, I'm out. Thank you. Good luck, guys. Thank Good you luck, so guys. Much. Good luck, guys. Good luck, guys. It's so a great you. product. Thank you. Thank you. They were great. They were great. And I love the product. I yeah, love this. Yeah, it's a this. great product. Super, I do. super smart. I think I made a mistake. They're down there somewhere. Just go down there and get them. We got a lot of good advice out there. I'm, I'm so I'm so sorry to interrupt. No Hi guys, Hi, I'm, nice I'm sorry to interrupt. Let me run something by you. My beautiful wife, Megatolia, for the last seven years has been working as an executive on the Method Mrs. Myers and Ecover soap oh brands. My God, that's so incredible. I think the two of us together, my wife and I could really help you get this thing off the ground. So does that sound like something you want to consider? Uh, what do you think? Is this a joke? <laughs> okay, it's not a joke. It's not a joke. But let's admit you're very early. Yes. And yeah. there are lots of things that need Definitely. to happen. And so yes. here's the way that I think about it. Mm. I'm happy to put in the $100,000. I would like to have 10% of the company. Yeah. However, for safety, what I would like to propose is a $1 royalty that pays back $1 per unit sold until I reach $200,000, at which point the royalty goes away. You have nothing else that you owe me besides the original 10%. And I'm doing this not just because I believe in SOPEN, I'm really doing it because I believe in you guys. And I wanna see you succeed. That is our offer, and I hope you accept it. If you don't, not a problem. We'll take We're the on. Day. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. We can't wait to meet your wife. Oh, yeah. Surprise.